so welcome back to my channel ageless beauty nation and in today's video we are doing a try on with maffy magnetic eyelashes and eyeliner i saw this product on amazon and it was only $7.99 and I have been lately a fan of wearing eyelashes. So I wanted to try it out and see how it works and see if it's a lot simpler than dealing with lash glue. And I mean, I know some of you girls out there are perfect at putting on the lash glue, applying the lashes. I, it's just not for me. So I wanted to look for an easier option. And I happened to see these. I've heard the buzz about them. And I wanted to check it out. So this is what it comes with. It has an eyelash applier, I'm thinking that is. And then it has uh, three different styles of eyelashes and the magnetic eyeliner. So um, I wanted to open it up in the box from, you know, so you guys can get a chance to take a look at it before I actually do the actual tutorial. It comes with a little card on tips, and it tells you how to use it, what's in the product, and the different steps that it takes to go ahead and, you know, apply this. So, we are going to get started. Hello, hello, hello. And so, I have my box here ready. Um, again, this is what it looked like. It's only $7.99 on Amazon. And I'll put the information down below. I'm not sponsored or anything in this video, but I wanted to check it out. And if it's something that you like, we can do this. So I'm going to number it and you tell me which lash is your favorite comment down below. Um, the bottom one will be number one. The middle will be number two. And then the top will be number three. Okay, so just comment down below which one is your favorite look and what your style of lashes would be. Okay, so first we're going to start by applying the magnetic liner. I hope you can kind of see what it looks like here. Um, I'm going to trim some of the liner off of the little, uh, I guess it's a tiny brush on the tip. And then I've already put my regular makeup, my got my makeup, lip gloss, and everything else on. So all I need to do is apply the eyeliner, and that's what it looks like in the little, in the little jar that it comes with. And so now um, I've I've just recently learned how to try to do a cat eye with liquid liner. It has not been an easy process for me, but after. Um, you know, different trials, I was able to, you know, somewhat semi perfect it, but hey, I like it. So, I mean, I know some of you girls are professional at putting on uh, eyeliner, um, doing the cat eye look, but this is what you are supposed to do. It has a magnetic effect in it. It looks like a regular eyeliner. It doesn't smell funny or unusual or anything, but it's it looks like typical eyeliner. It's just a, has um, a magnetic effect inside the actual liner fluid itself. So once you finish applying the eyeliner on your eye, then I think the next step, which I'll show you guys coming up, is um, what the actual magnets on the uh, lash itself look like. So that's why I just completed one eye. And I'm trying to perfect it without <laughs> without messing up anything, but I think I did pretty good. So I'm going to now put eyeliner on the other eye. One thing I will say about the actual eyeliner container, it was kind of, I don't know, it's kind of not easy to get out of the little jar or whatever. Um, I don't know how much fluid they put in it. I couldn't really tell, but you know, it's just enough for me at least to do this. I mean, I don't see it as a big deal i've tried other magnetic lash liners and um it came out of the bottle pretty simple so i don't know this one here i'm gonna just have to get used to that but other and you know other than that the liner in itself it's color black um it's just like any other eyeliner fluid where you know you can just draw your line just like you want it whether you're trying to do a wing tip, like a, a powerful wing tip, you know, how some of them go way out there, or you're just trying to do something basic, like what I'm trying to do just to try on the lashes. So 
it says to allow it to dry for about a minute or so and so that's what I'm doing a um, few moments later okay so I have allowed it to dry and we're going to try with lash set number one lash set number one is kind of really a natural look it's not a lot of bristles and I'm going to try this lash applicator I'm not a fan of it. I'm more hands-on, but I'm going to try it for this video. And, of course, if it don't work for me, I'm going to put it down. So, I'm just telling you right now. But you can see the little magnets on there. And they're very light. It's not something that's heavy. So, I'm going to try to use the lash applicator to, you know, put the lash, the first set of lashes on. And, you know, see how it works. And yeah it's just not my my forte when it comes to using that so I'm just gonna use my fingers like I thought and to me just putting it on with my fingers it was very easy to apply easy peasy and see that's what I was looking for something that I can just use without dealing with glue and putting all that stuff on my eye so that one was pretty easy. And you guys, again, tell me what you think about this particular style. It's a more natural look. Now, with this eye, I was having a little bit of difficulty. And I don't know if maybe I didn't put a thick amount of the liner on when I was trying to apply my liner. Because it I, normally they say to put about two coats or so. But I think in this case, I needed a little bit more liner. So I don't think it's the product itself that was a problem or even the lash itself. But I just think that the liner, I didn't apply the amount that was needed. So um, I kind of struggled with this one. But to me, it was no big deal because eventually I was able to get it on. I said, let me take it off. And I'll restart it again because I'm not going to get frustrated with this. I do, however, like the other eye, guys. The first one, I'm, I like a more natural look. I know some girls like the the big and bold lashes. You know, hey, I'm 49 years old. I kind of want to kind of keep it simple. So and that's just me. I'm not knocking anybody else for what they like. This is just what I like. So that's exactly what the lash look like. It's cute very nice and easy let me know down in the comments if this is um uh, your this is lash set number one so comment which one is uh one that you think would be your favorite and which one looks pretty good on me okay so i think this one is kind of cute um we'll see what the other two are gonna look like and you know, it, it's not heavy at all, so I was glad about that. I didn't feel the magnets on my eyelids. So I think that was so far so good, guys. I really like this one. Okay, so we're going to get started with our second set. This one has a little bit more lash on the, li on the lash line. So it's a little bit more bolder. <clears throat> excuse me then the first one and you know I'm gonna put these on and apply this one and you tell me if what do you think about this one so that one see I think I had enough liner on that eye because my right eye which is what this is it was easy to apply um now I'm gonna put the left one on and you know it wasn't as much as a struggle as the first set of lashes and i don't i don't know maybe a magnet wasn't but i think these are really cute too it's in between you know it's it's not like the first one which is more natural it has a little bit something extra but it's not over the top guys i think this one is really cute too so tell me if you like this one as well i mean if number one was your favorite or number two of course we still got number three coming up but i think this one this one is pretty cool it was easy to apply and everything i like this one so you guys tell me what you think and again it's the the magnets i really don't feel it it's not heavy on my eye or anything and this is set number two you guys so Comment about down below, you know, which one is uh, one you think looks nice on me and which one you would like for yourself. And now we are ready for number three.
Okay, so we are getting ready to try on last set number three. This is one of our boldest looks. So number one was kind of natural. Number two was a little something extra. And number three is more of a bolder look. It has more lashes, more length, more thickness. So let's put this one on and see what this is going to look like. Okay. So this one came out really cute. I like that little extra pop when it comes to the, um, the end. I had to kind of fix it a little bit, but no big deal. It wasn't something that was out of the ordinary. Um, I kind of, I don't know if this one, maybe I had it too far in the corner, but hey, you guys tell me which one you like. So I'm going to put the other one on my left eye. And we're going to see how this one with the both sets together, what they're going to look like. So this one went on pretty much with ease as well. Um, these are really, really long. I might, I'm wondering on the tip. Okay. So there's my wing tip sticking out on the left side. It looks like it's kind of hanging on that side, but I think maybe I pushed it too far in the corner. I'm not sure, but I decided to take it off and, you know, reapply it. So we'll see if I kind of pushed it up toward the, you know, the corner of my eyelid to see if to balance out everything and we'll see how it works out. But I mean, this one is not so bad. Gives me the lift and a little bit more lash, a little bit more thickness. And everything so tell me this is number three guys tell me what you think about this one um, I guess one more dramatic look I might sport this one and I kind of wish the lighting was a little bit better so you guys can really get a good look up close and see you know how long and how thick these lashes are this is again number three so just remember to comment down below and let me know which one is your favorite. So this is what the uh, eyelash tutorial is today. Um, I'm going to put the information on where to find these on Amazon. It's only $7.99. I mean, you get three sets of lashes, a lash applicator, and magnetic eyeliner. So I thought it was pretty cool. If I had to judge it, I'll give it about a nine because I had to kind of do a little readjustment. I don't think it's an issue with the product. Maybe it was a little bit of my application of the liner. But other than that, I really didn't have too many issues. It was easy to wash off when I got ready to take it off. So, you know, no big deal with that. Um, let me know if you want me to try on any other, you know, kind of quirky items, especially when it deals with makeup, skincare, or even clothes, because I do try on hauls with clothes like Shein and Boohoo and stuff like that. So this is what the third lash looks like up close. I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe and share this video, and we will see you next time.